Sorry about the blooper before. You'll see it on video. Uh, I want to talk about the internet. I was already told if you put something up there, it will never come down. Whatsoever. Up until recently, my videos kept disappearing off my Facebook page. It seemed like most of the people I was friends with never got my videos I posted. Um, if you Google search me, there's nothing about me in the recent last five to eight years on Google, Yahoo, or any other search engine. Even though I ran for Congress in 10, 12, and 14, and I had all kind of news and video reports from news agencies and TV stations and candidate forums on the internet about me. And all these socials, like the right to life, the right to abortion, right to own guns, anti-guns, all these right to have a bicycle lane everywhere in America groups. Uh, they all commented on me and my stand on things, and now they're all gone. You Google my name, even stuff I post now doesn't go up on Google search. My website, GoDaddy, at RayBlight.com, .com, doesn't come up on Google and Yahoo search. They've eliminated me from the public. What are they scared of? Oh. The evidence I have that can overturn a half a million Howard County circuit court cases for over 30 years of corruption in that court through many prosecutors, many judges, and police officers doing anything they had to to get convictions because they were all immune to do it. It wasn't illegal. How could they do this to me? I'm running for U.S. Congress again. And if you Google search me, you will never find this video. But hopefully enough of you will see it on Facebook and YouTube and share it with everybody you know so it spreads around the world of what they can do to you as a citizen. They've even hid my criminal record off the computer files for the last six months, according to lawyers I've tried to hire. Uh, according to our computer search of the court records, you don't have a criminal record, they tell me. <coughs> they have to dig and dig and dig and then call a courthouse to find out I actually was convicted of a crime and have a felony conviction. For some reason, they don't want the American public to know anything about me because I am too big of a threat. I'm a bigger threat to this county than Edward Snowden was to the U.S. government. <laughs> with the documented proof I have. And now they got me mentally ill, too? So long, Charlie.